Give it up for the Mavericks! Okay, we are here as as uh, name of the group Kansas City Butt Rubbers. As the KC Kansas City Butt Rubbers, put us a B U T T. <laughs> uh, pick out their uh, winning selection, the uh, the one that they're sending to the judges, and uh, what are the thoughts behind this? Well, carefully manicured skins, mm -hmm. deboned chicken, mm -hmm. with a sweet sauce on top. With the sweet sauce on top, he says. That's a, that's a sweet, sweet deal in itself. So, what uh, what are the expectations? High. High expectations for this one. This one is uh, going to the to the to the championship, right? Yeah. Top ten at least. Top ten. Top ten is that a prediction? Yes. Take a step back with the camera. Here we go. On. I'm gonna. Get a glimpse of this winning. You got it on camera. Look at that. That is beautiful. That is so oh man, that just looks scrumptious. And that's a horrible word to use. Um, <laughs> I'll tell you what, those are all throwaways, so you can actually try one when uh oh my God. <laughs> you'll uh, you'll give us I, I love my job. <laughs> <laughs> and you can give us your own opinion. Alright, let's uh I close her up, turn her in. Yeah. Here we have this. This is Paul Michael Davis, MCTV, uh, county based and community focused. Uh, MCTVlive.com. It's the new uh, social network for individual counties, and we are going to try. Ah, uh, this this if this is a winner. I'm gonna. I'm gonna we'll see. We'll I'm so see. So excited. So in 50 Yeah, yeah. Whichever one looks good for you. That's it. Oh my God. Looking for a bite through here, all the way through. Yeah, that's the it's key actually to the chicken is the bite through skin. Yeah, and just a smell. I mean, you can actually feel when you grab a hold of it. You can feel the the tender, the juice, the. It's a good start. My mouth is watering. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to open my mouth and have just saliva just dripping out. Mmm. <laughs> oh, came right through. Skin's perfect. Well, what do you think? Oh, 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 oh. I'm mean, <laughs> take this in, all right? I'm trying to soak it in. I'm trying to. Let me play, but what we got? Here, don't throw it. Yeah, let me eat them. I don't need a whole chicken. I don't really Okay, I'm not one of the judges, unfortunately, because that is an amazing job to have. But this right here, this is a PT Pier. It's all right. Hit <laughs> primetime player. Come on. Nice. Man might, a, man might need a man might need a paper towel. Yeah. All right. We're like this. Got a little spice to it too. All right. That's good too. You been out here all morning? Well, uh, most of it. Yeah. Four out of four skin. Perfect. I'm all right. Four out of four. Nice. Got your water. Two out of four. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not trying to be rude. I might come back back and I sit this down and eat it later because I got a. Thousand more. Yeah, yeah. People yeah. To go to and you got stuff to do. Oh my well, god, this is, taste. this is amazing. Yeah. He likes it, Mark. All right. That's for. Oh, let's go on. Okay. Yeah, take the mic, take control. People are tired of watching me eat. Let's go on camera. All right. So space those. So, uh, so yeah, we're the KC Butt Rubbers. Uh, we hail out of uh, Prairie Village, so Kansas City area. Payola. Hey guys, how long have we been doing payola? Eight or nine? Eight or nine years? 
I think uh, we had a top ten in ribs last year. We've uh, placed a couple times. I think one sausage one year. Um, so uh, so looking for good things. Looking for this chicken that you guys just saw to come through uh, today and get a get a top ten, get a call in chicken. That's what we're looking for today. All right. So, now would you say this is your specialty? Uh, you know, each one of us actually does one of the meats really? in, the, in the competition, so each one of us essentially has our own specialty. So, and this is Mark's? Yeah. Okay. Mark? 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 Nice word. Thank you. Nice Appreciate word. It. So, uh, all right. Obviously, you guys have been coming to me. I usually ask me here, did you come here to win or lose? Hey, we uh, uh, came to have fun. Number one. And number one. That's, that's a good call. Cool. To get a call. Yeah, we like to get a call. Ten. Top ten. Top in one of, one of the categories. And we get a top ten in a couple, then we're looking for a top ten overall. So, I mean, you, you got to be looking for the grand prize for the, for, for the trip to Kimperina. Yeah. Hey, you know, that's... If that uh, happens, we'd be very excited. Yeah. Uh, All right. Where are we looking for? Paul Michael Davis, mctvlive.com. Place to be. Here with the uh, Kansas City Butt Rubbers, B-U-T-T. <laughs> and guys, good luck. All right. Hey, thanks, thanks a lot. No Appreciate problem. It. All right, so we're going. Hey, thank you, buddy. <laughs> so we got people uh, interrupting us. And, all right, so on the next person. So what are they doing exactly? We uh, we cook our ribs to a certain temperature and a texture, and then just prior to turning them, we make sure that they're good and hot, so that when we turn them in, they're as hot as they can possibly be for the judges. So. Uh, we've determined which is the best slab of ribs, the second best and the third best. And obviously we'll turn in the first, second, and then third. And uh, so we put it back on, we've numbered them. And uh, once they get reheated, we'll pull them off just prior to turn in and uh, slice them and turn them in. So what is, what is your specialty? Uh, at the Lenexa barbecue this year, we took first place at pork. So I'd have to say at this point in time, we've done pretty well at pork. Really? Uh, but uh, really, truly, our sausage has always done well. Of course, sausage is not part of the BCS, our Kansas City Barbecue Society uh, competition, but uh, we do very well in sausage, uh, and then would be our ribs and our brisket. Uh, we've done very well with brisket uh, over the last several years. So the question of the day, I mean, we ask this everybody. I mean, very well, yeah, everybody we ask this to, uh, dry or wet? Driver, we use we use a dry rub. Yeah, yeah, yeah we, we use our dry rub, and then we use moisture techniques throughout the cooking process to keep the meat moist. And then uh, we uh, we are a team that turns it everything with our homemade barbecue sauce on it. Now, uh, what heat, what heat do you who do the ribs at? We or try to. Our uh, cooking concepts are down to where uh, we're at 224 degrees throughout the entire process nice. for everything. We've Low tried and slow. tested. Well, we do start at 180. Uh -huh. uh, we smoke everything nice, at yeah. 180. Low, low. Yeah, we, we go 180 on everything smoked, and then we uh, uh, when it's once we get everything smoked, then we turn the temperature to 224 to cook it. Well, see, I, I, I talk to you about slow and slow, but you go low, low, and slow, slow. So you do that. Is, that is, that is do, correct. You do double time. That is correct. So now, uh, tell me, partner, what's your uh, what's the name of your team? I was Brownies Barbecue. Uh, I, I was the uh, first round brownie, and I passed the reins. And the, we had an apron pressing ceremony to my son Chris uh, last year, so. Uh, he's the new generation of Brownies uh, Barbecue uh, with all the young that. guys. <laughs> all right. well, so uh, uh, we'll go talk to him real quick and then we'll uh, yeah, you're right. Okay, good deal. Thank you, right, sir. Thank you. All right, let's go talk to uh, and his name? Chris. Let's go talk to uh, Brownie Jr. <laughs> all right, I'm sorry. I completely went on by. I got your team name. I got your son's name. And uh, we didn't get your name. Well, what we had to do is we did this apron passing ceremony last year. Mm -hmm. And I gave him the family name of Brownies Barbecue. Passed it on to my son. And once I did that, I had to come up with my new moniker, so uh, I just simply named myself the Einstein of Swine with our good uh, showings in pork, typically. <laughs> All right, Einstein of Swine. <laughs> Thank you. All right, thank you, sir. Good luck, guys. All right, so we're here with the heir to the throne, the, uh, the, the, the new, well, I, I dare I say the um, junior Einstein of Swine. Uh, sure. The Duke of Pork. <laughs> the Duke of Pork. <laughs> All right, so uh, we were talking to your dad. Uh, passing the apron, he took over the, I mean, the, the full run, the, the leadership of this, this group. Now, what a, okay, just to, I mean, coincide stories, just a, for clarification, what is your uh, specialty? Uh, probably pork. Pork. We pork. first the pork about a month ago. Okay. Out of 180 teams. Now, all right, so how, how juicy is your pork? 
A juicy? Yeah. I mean, on a scale, on a scale of one to ten, from a, a drip of water to a waterfall. It's not too juicy. If it's too juicy, it'll be mushy in your mouth. But you know what it is? I think it's the sauce. We got a really sweet sauce that we put on it. I think that's what wins the judges over. Nice. So the sauce, I mean, is it homemade? Oh yeah, it, it came from that guy. <laughs> Actually, it came from distant relatives, passed down through him to me, and we've, I mean, we've tweaked it over the years, but we've been using the same sauce more or less for about 15 years. Wow. All right. So, what is your expectations of this competition? Do you, I mean, a lot of people, I mean, I've asked, are you here to win or lose? Are you here to win a party? Are you here for business or play? A little of both. Oh, I, yeah. uh, I would love to win, but I've taken dead last and I've taken first. I've been all over the place, so I don't know. You never know. I'm, I mean, I'm still, we've turned in two or three, two categories so far. And basically, it's, it's how the judges feel when they wake up in the morning. I mean, they feel a lot of it's subjective. You can do a lot to put yourself in the running, you uh -huh. know, to get yourself in the top 10 or 20, but after that, it's really subjective. Uh -huh. It really is. All right, and team name again is Brownies? Brownies Barbecue. Brownies Barbecue. All right, is there anywhere that, uh, like, the viewers of MCTV can get a hold of you if they want to get them um, uh, Browniesbarbecue.com. Brownies Barbecue, Brownies Barbecue.com. Is that spelled out? Brownies BBQ.com. We're also on Twitter, Brownies BBQ. Oh, all right. So Brownies BBQ, Brownies BBQ.com. We'll get yours, all right? The Iron Set of Swine, the. the, the Duke of Fork. Duke of Fork. Uh, all right, man. Good luck. All right. Guys. Thanks a lot. Well, have a good one. Tip to my running.